Hi everyone, welcome to the File Audit tutorial. With this video we're going to run through how to install and configure File Audit. The first thing to cover is what are the requirements. File Audit can be installed on any Windows machine, from Windows XP and Windows Server 2003, right up to the most recent versions. It only requires the .NET Framework 3.5 SP1. To store all collected events, File Audit requires the use of a database. It can be a Microsoft Access file, Microsoft SQL Server, or Microsoft SQL Express. To make things easy during the evaluation process, we include an Access database for you. So let's download the File Audit software. You can find it on the IS Decisions website. Go to the File Audit page and click on Download. It will only take a couple of minutes. Once you have downloaded the software, the next step is to choose the machine which will host File Audit. There is no mandatory requirement to install File Audit on the system that is to be audited. Any machine meeting the requirements can be used as a remote host for File Audit. The server we then remotely audit requires no further installation. Now let's install File Audit on a Windows 8 workstation to audit remotely some Windows 2012 file servers. To launch the installation process, run the file audit package with an administrator account. Choose your language preference and click OK. The installation wizard will open to guide you through the process. Click Next to begin. Read the end user license agreement. To continue, accept it and click on Next. Enter your customer information. You may skip this step if you want. Here you can choose to change the default installation folder. For this example we will keep the default option. There are two installation modes, Complete, which installs all File Audit components, and Custom, which lets you choose which components will be installed. Let's keep Complete selected. We will run through the Custom mode on another tutorial. Three components are now ready to be installed. The File Audit window service, which is the Audit Engine, the Console, to manage the service and display the audit, and the Software Documentations. Click on Finish to close the wizard and open the File Audit console. Opening the File Audit console reveals a Windows 8-like tile-based look. Let's see on the next video more about the basic settings.